Okay, I have another wireless, uh, what is this, microphone. Lightweight, noise reduction, wireless, radio, durable. Okay, how's battery durable? Okay, open it cover, start up, class 2.4, 6 hours, type C, got the case. Let's pop it open. Um... Ugh. All right, let's throw that out there. Right now. My, let's go. Instructions. Pause it if you want to read it. I'll get a little closer. I'm assuming this is just a type C charger. They make these boxes harder and harder to get into. All right. So, oh, look at that. Two type C's. Why? All right. This is, why? Why do you need... Okay, maybe there, there's a receiver in there. Alright. So, there's two type C's. Oh, it's black and shiny. I thought it was white. Alright. Type C on the back for charging. Is there any lights? No lights. This is a shiny plastic box. There is no light whatsoever. Hold on, let me check something. Okay, I am wrong. This is a light. Uh, let's see how I get this. Stay open. I can't even get this thing out. Alright, so this is a type C. If you wanted to do wanted to plug it into an iPhone, you do it that way. Type C. Power is gonna be type C going in. The light's gonna blink. That's not a button. Uh Oh, it's magnetized. Let's pull these off. This is where you're going to see the lights light up. Let's pull this one off. Get out of the way. Alright. So, plug that in. This is These are the lights. And they're magnet. Tells you which one, right and left. Does it know the difference or is it just, yeah, it just, that one's the left, this one's always the right. It's just there. Just showing you two indications. Why is the other one not lit up? Well, there we go. How much power you got left in this box, I guess? It's charging. Oh, it's open it. Oh, these are hard to get out. These are just like really cheap plastic. I mean, there's no texture to it or anything. This has got little clips. This is like really cheaply made. Uh, this one's got a cover over it. Yeah, you can pull off the little cover. Uh, type C, I guess that's why they give you the two ports for the type C in case you want to charge them up individually then you wouldn't need the case I'm confused one case just an option I guess 
I don't know. They wanted to make sure you, you could do it. All right. So anyway, let's see. That's the connecting one. Uh, the one in the middle. Is this a button? Yeah. That turns it off. Turns it back on. If you tap it. Maybe I'm not connected. Well, we'll have to do this when we test the audio. All right. Let's go test the audio. All right. I'm going to do this one now. That's already plugged in. You should be able to hear me by now. I'm going to plug it in. It's right there. This one does not have a wind deflector. So you're going to hear a lot of wind. So move a little closer and you hear all the wind. If I have my back towards you. Oh wait a minute, the light's not blinking. Hold on. I was blinking earlier. And the green lights back on. Oh my goodness. Is the distance that short? I'm going to put the microphone behind me. I want to see if the light stops blinking. behind me so you're losing transmission power or you're being disconnected or something I don't know let's go down here if you're not facing it directly this little receiver disconnects from that well, that's not good that's not good at all I could just put this like I got my hands over the microphone right now. Let's see what happens. Can you hear? Do you get a signal now? Let me back up. So, this only works at line of sight. So, all that walking back there was useless. I'm standing right here. And if I take this and put it behind my back, it will no longer work. Ha <laughs> Nice to know. See you inside. Okay. What do I have to say about this? <sighs> This only works in the line of sight. Anytime there's something in between this and the receiver. Let's see if I can get the receiver out. Anytime there's something between this and the receiver, it cuts out. It is disconnected. That little, that little connection right there goes out. This blinks green when it's recording, but then there's no light. When this gets disconnected. <sighs> Alright. Uh, I did all that walking. And this is the line of sight. That means the antenna on here is not very good. As you heard, uh, I sped it up. But at 60 feet... You were kind of hearing me. It was kind of connecting. 
when I was looking at you, but you couldn't understand anything that, that was coming out. When I got up to 30 feet and I was looking at you, it kind of would go in and out. I would say I was up to maybe 20 feet. The 25 is when you started hearing me. I'm going to say 20 feet. If you are 20 feet away and are not in the line of sight of this, then this is going to go out. This is going to get disconnected. So if the camera is not, if this is not in line of sight with this, then you're going to get disconnected at 20 feet. I mean, at one point, I had my hands covering it like this, and it went out, and you could not hear me. So, uh, I do not recommend this one. I don't know how much this one is, but uh, I'll leave it down below and a link so you guys can go see it. But I do not recommend you buying this because it's going to be useless. When there's lots of better, cheaper microphones out there. Yeah, it's got this cool little display on it, but I wish they would have spent more money on the receiver in here so that it wasn't line of sight. Because you can't use these line of sight. I mean, you think about it. If you, you sit like two chairs like that, and you have a camera. If you're sitting like this, you have a camera, and you reach over and you hand another person a drink and your arm gets in the way, then you've lost that connection. Certain little things of getting up and moving around, you'd lose that connection. And that's not good for somebody who's interviewing 20 feet away. That's not good at all. Uh, yeah, I'd pass on this. This they didn't look into it very well. Uh, there's no labels on the inside of this at all. There's no nothing marked the name, anything. There's nothing on it. This box has marked what's in there, but there is no name whatsoever. Just says it comes from China. But yeah, uh, I'd pass on this one. Definitely pass on it, but I will put a link down below uh, if you want to use that link um, or just check it out. Just look at it and find out what other people are saying about it. Um, that's just, it's so freaking hilarious that this, this, I, I don't know, somebody tried to get I don't know how many of these got sold or whatever. If you see any one, any of them online that look like this, I'd almost stay away from them because this is not a good product. I'm glad I got a hold of one of these so it, you guys don't get ripped off. Um, this is... I'd be totally mad if I bought this. But... Uh, all right, uh, well, I buy this so you guys don't get ripped off spending your good money. I'm going to chuck this in the trash. Uh, this ain't even worth shipping out. All right, uh, all right, uh, if you got anything out of this, um, Give me a like if you want to see other microphones. Subscribe if you have any thoughts about this or if you've accidentally bought this or whatever or what you think about this cheap piece of plastic. Um, yeah, uh, write it down below. Let me know. I'd like to hear a little feedback. Ah, uh, guess I'll talk to you later. Bye.